Perhaps you have a rough idea about how exercise affects your health, weight, and energy levels. But do you know about its impact on the brain? The neurological benefits are clear and significant. These benefits are seen throughout the lifespan, including among those living with serious mental and physical health challenges. That's true whether their preferred activity is walking, running, swimming, dancing, biking, playing sports, lifting weights, or practicing yoga. But what exactly is happening in the body and brain during exercise? As your heart rate increases during exercise, blood flow to the brain increases. As blood flow increases, your brain is exposed to more oxygen and nutrients. Exercise also induces the release of beneficial proteins in the brain. These nourishing proteins keep brain cells, or neurons, healthy, and promote the growth of new neurons. Neurons are the working building blocks of the brain. As a result, individual neuron health is important to overall brain health. Here are six interesting ways exercise affects your brain. 1. Improve memory. Aerobic exercise like walking, jogging, or gardening may help your brain's hippocampus. The part that's linked to memory and learning, grow. It also might slow the shrinking of your hippocampus that can lead to memory loss as you get older. Some studies suggest the regrowth is stronger if you like the activity you're doing. So find something you enjoy and get going. 2. Exercise can make your brain more sensitive to joy. When you exercise, you provide a low-dose jolt to the brain's reward centers, the system of the brain that helps you anticipate pleasure, feel motivated, and maintain hope. Over time, regular exercise remodels the reward system, leading to higher circulating levels of dopamine and more available dopamine receptors. In this way, exercise can both relieve depression and expand your capacity for joy. 3. It can make your brain more flexible. Neuroplasticity is the ability of your brain to change when you learn and experience new things. Younger brains are generally better than older ones at doing this, but even those of the same age can have very different capacities. Scientists believe both aerobic exercise and weight training seem to help make more flexible, or, plastic, brains. 4. Exercise makes you brave. Courage is another side effect of physical activity on the brain. At the very same time that a new exercise habit is enhancing the reward system, it also increases neural connections among areas of the brain that calm anxiety. Regular physical activity can also modify the default state of the nervous system so that it becomes more balanced and less prone to fight, flight, or fright. 5. It helps you connect the dots. Research suggests exercise improves your ability to organize and interpret information, and act in a way that makes sense something called executive function just one session of exercise can start the process over the long term exercise seems to change structure of white matter in your brain in a way that helps brain cells connect 6. transform your self-image every time you move your body sensory receptors in your muscles tendons and joints send information to your brain about what is happening this is why if you close your eyes and raise one arm you can feel the shift in position and know where your arm is in space. You don't have to watch what's happening, you can sense yourself. The ability to perceive your body's movements is called proprioception, and is sometimes referred to as the sixth sense. It helps us move through space with ease and skill and plays a surprisingly important role in self-concept. How you think about who you are and how you imagine others see you. What exercises specifically enhance brain function? The best type of exercise for your brain is the one that you like because enjoyment is the most important factor. Even a 30-minute walk every day is good for your brain. Regular aerobic exercise, that raises your heart rate, is good for your brain because an increased intensity level causes more growth factors and neurochemicals to arise. This will have a positive impact on your stress levels, learning, and memory. HIIT is a great option for exercising your brain because there is evidence that it causes different types of benefits compared to low-intensity aerobic exercise, such as increased endothelial function. Resistance training could also be very beneficial, if executed correctly, as studies have shown that it leaves you with meaningful functional brain changes, especially in the frontal lobe, which are accompanied by improvements in executive functions. So there you go, start exercising and improve your brain function.